Hey guys. <clears throat> Three. The Resident Evil 2 remake. It's not scary. It has a lot of flaws. I mean, I, I, I am serious. Difficulty? Fucking awful. I mean, hardcore mode would be great if, one, you could actually have a non-breakable knife. I mean, this is something a lot of people are, gonna, are not going to know is, well, what you're going to do is look for the Mr. Raccoon toys throughout the game. Uh, break all of them on assist mode, on the assisted mode, which is the easy mode. Just so you can have the unbreakable knife. Because, well, playing the game on hardcore mode is absolute fucking garbage. It, you have limited saves. So, why can't your knife be unlimited? I mean, you're killing the player. You can't save your game. And if you do, you might not be able to save anymore. Now, this would be fine if it was for easy mode only. Because they would just give you so many. But... It's limited saves in a game in 2014, I mean 2018, Jesus Christ, 2014, it's like, oh no. No, limited saves shouldn't be in games. That's just a waste of the player's time. I mean, let's put this one into perspective really quick. While I'm being nice is, what if you go to your grandma's funeral today and you gotta save the game? If you save once, you're fucked because that's your last save per like fucking 20 hours I mean I want you to tell you this every boss is ridiculously ridiculous because they take out way too much ammo I mean they force you to fight Sherry's dad in both campaigns uh for well it's not that bad I mean on fucking standard and easy mode it's simple I mean Claire has the easier fucking run because she gets a grenade launcher which has fucking fire and acid and she, she just kills the liquors really fast. Where Leon's campaign is slightly easier. But it's obnoxious as well. I mean, both of them are obnoxious. But Claire has better weapons where Leon has less deadly enemies. Which is... Uh, I mean, this game, this game isn't scary. It... Mr. X is just an annoyance. I think in Leon's campaign, he sticks around where in Claire's, he just dies. That's it. There's just no difference. I mean, it, I, I hate the fact that you took out saving for hardcore mode. I'm not, I'm not going to play it. I mean, I'm, I'm probably going to play it when I have the Unbreakable Knife. Because I don't think that counts towards not getting an S rank. Because I want to get everything in the game. Except online nonsense. Other than that, I'm going to get as many things done. Except maybe minimalist. Because I have a bad habit of going, uh, no. I mean, a lot of stuff, like, that, that's ridiculous. I mean, some of these things are, don't ever use the item box. Which is dumb. Which I, I, can, I can go, okay, fine. I can live with throwing away stuff. Which is obnoxious. I, I I'm serious. It's just this guy. I don't, I'm a, I don't know how you want me to feel. I mean, I think the fact that you they tell you when you can throw away items is actually fantastic. But I don't get why you don't just get rid of them when it's done. Just automatically your space is empty. I mean, I'm I'm not I'm not. That's not the point. The game is not scary. I I don't get why people are so scared. Mister X is just hey, I'm gonna bother you. And here's something you didn't know. Just use a flashbang if you have one. Just don't use the knife. Just try to flashbang him because he'll he'll just stop. It count. It's like how you if you shoot him in the head ten times, he stops. But not a hardcore mode because that is a waste of your time. If you use the Magnum for Leon, he fucking stops because he's been hit like one time in the head too. I mean Leon Leon literally has to deal with this guy for like bajillion times throughout this entire game so just make a lot of magnum ammo if you feel like you're going to waste it on him because guys this game i've been talking for like maybe 10 20 minutes i fucking know i mean it's, it's 9 14 I, I i this game is hard 
I think it's just obnoxious. Like, yeah, animal scarce. But I had, I, I want you to know, if you know what you're doing, you can have like more than sixty ammo, and that's not even on assisted mode. You can get a shit ton of ammo by just running away, which is possible. But there's points in the game where you just can't do anything. Like zombies will just fill up the area, and you're you're just expected to know this. That would be fine if you had the items to block away all the enemies for showing up more, which you don't. I mean, I mean the boards of wood are interesting, but they don't forewarn you. Uh, there's just no reason to have them. I feel like if you're going to have enemies show up, have them show up and be fair. Because a lot of, like, every enemy in the game doesn't do anything. I'm serious. They don't do anything until you progress the plot. I mean, I'm serious. I think when you get the shotgun or one of the other things in this game, a, a, a literal character who's been dead literally just gets up and just says, Oh, I'm going to kill you. This game is ridiculous. I mean, before Mr. X, the game just gets really ridiculous in hardcore mode because enemies actually move faster. And I just go, fucking wasting my time. I mean, I get it. It's hard mode. But I already have limited saves. I mean, unless I'm doing a new game plus on hard mode, there's no actual fucking point to play the game. I mean, shooting the enemies in the knee stuns them if you shoot them like twice. Where headshots don't even do enough to kill. I I'm serious. Play the early parts of the game and just go for knee shots. And just try to run. Enemies actually, they really do move faster. I just, this game... The game makes me so mad. Because the fucking map is garbage. I mean... People say it's good. And the only time I actually... I, I barely could figure out the map. I mean, the only time I figured out anything useful from the map was like, Oh, there's items here. That's about it. That's bad. When, when, I mean, the map could be useful, but it's not. I, I, I'm serious. You thought you thought the map was good? No, it's fucking awful. I mean, I never play games and care about the map, but when the map's a core feature to help me get not lost and it makes me more lost, I think you're doing something wrong. I mean, you can um, one thing you can just do since it's like fuck, it's 2019. I'm a I'm dum dum. I'm a I'm a dum dum guys. I mean, one of the things you can do is look around in the game. Uh, I'm serious. If you know the codes to anything in the game, you can open up all the all the storage nonsense early. And I recommend you do that because before you actually start progressing the plot, you can get Leon. Yes, Leon. Two free upgrades to his handgun. One of them is to make him have better accuracy, which you can get right away by going to the top hall to the right and literally putting in the code. I was like, I'm not going to say the code, because that might spoil the fun of finding it. Then you want to get the one where it says Ned and MRG. For, for there's, there's like, it, it's fucking awful. I mean, Mr. X is just obnoxious, but at least I can, I know the tricks. But, it's just too much. I mean, hard mode would be bearable if, you know, I can actually save. I mean... Uh, guys, this game is ridiculous.